بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله In this Nur al-Quran reflection series we try to develop a relation with the Quran through both understanding and memorization and in lesson B we will go over the translation word for word of the Quran and the word roots of each word inshallah and in part A of the of the series we will go over the other items on this list here Okay, so this lesson is the eighth quarter of the fourth juz of the Qur'an. So that's the second quarter of Surah An-Nisa, and that is three quarters of his eighth of the Qur'an. And it starts with, A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajim, bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, wa lakum nusfu ma taraka azwajukum. And this is um, ayah number 12 of Surah An-Nisa. Okay, so we said this quarter is three pages. We have three here on this side, five on this page, and then uh, four here on this side. So let's start, inshallah, with ayah number 12. A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajim. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Wa lakum nusfu ma taraka azwajukum. And for you, uh, so lakum is to you. Nusf, that's uh, half from nasafa, that's to divide into two. Ma taraka, so taraka is to leave from taraka, that's the word root. And azwajukum, that's from zawaja. Zawaja is to pair, so azwaj is the plural of zawj, and zawj is a spouse or a pair. And azwaj means your spouses, azwajukum, yours. So kum is your, your spouses or your wives here. In lam, so in is if, lam is not. Yakun from Kawana, and that means to be. So Yakun Lahunna Walad means that they do not have a child. Lahunna means to them, and that's Hunna here is a feminine plural. Walad from Walada, and that's a child. So that's for both male or female child, um, if, if they have no child. Fa'in Kana, so if they. If, if there was to them, so that's what it means. In lam yakul lahunna, it means if there was no, uh, if, if there was to them no child. In kana lahunna walad, if they had a child, falakum to you a rubu. So rubu is from uh, raba, and that's from the word for in Arabic, and so rubu is a quarter. Mimma from what? Mimma uh, tarakna. Tarakn is from taraka, again, to leave, so from what they left, a quarter of what they left. So, if they have a child for you, is one-fourth of what they leave. Mim ba'di, from after, wasliya, from wasliya, and that's uh, to to give a will, or uh, to give an order, wasliya, or a will. Yulsina, uh, again, from wasliya, and that's to make a will. Biha uh, aw. Dain. Dain is from Dayana and that's a debt. So after any bequest they may have made or debt. Walahunna and to them a rubu a quarter mimma taraktum from what you have left in lam yakun lakum walad. If you but uh, if you leave uh, for them, for the wives is one fourth if you leave no child, if you do not have a child. Fa'in kana lakum walad and if you leave a child Falahunna, and to them is a thumun, and again a thumun is from thamaniya, and that's eight, so thumun is one eighth. Mimma taraktum, an eighth of what you leave, min ba'di wasiyatin tulsuna biha awdain, after any bequest you may have made or debt. Wa in kana means uh, if, if it was rajul, uh, rajul aw imra'a, so rajul aw imra'a means a man or a woman. Yurathu kalala. Yurath is from waratha, and that's to inherit uh, kalala. Uh, that's from kalala, and that's someone who doesn't have uh, ascendants or descendants, does not leave uh, any parents or children behind. Walahu akh, to him is a, an akh or ukht. Akh is a brother, and ukht is a sister. So whether that person has a uh, brother or sister, falikulli wahid, to each one. So wahid is from wahada, that's one. So to each one, min huma of them, as sudus, and sudus is from the uh, number sitta, which is six. So sudus is one sixth. Fa'in kanu, if they were akthara min dalik, um, so if they are more than two, akthara is from kathara, and that's more um, akthara min dalik, more than that. Fahum shuraka, again from sharaka, that's a partnership. So it means that they will, will become partners in a thuluth. So they, they will share a thuluth. And a thuluth is from thalatha. 
ثلاثة is three so الثلث is one third من بعد وصية يوصى بها أو دين so here it's يوصى that's the passive form of the verb so after um, any bequest which was made so any bequest that was made uh, here we don't have يوصي or توصونا or يوصينا we have يوصى so just in the passive form أو دين غير means not and مضار from ضرر and that's uh, harm or detriment. So as long as there is no detriment caused, وصيتهم من الله وصية from وصية, um, and that's an ordinance from Allah. So again, from وصية is to make an order or to make a will. So here, وصية من الله is an ordinance from Allah. والله and Allah is عليم from عليمة is to know. So عليم is all knowing and حليم is from حلمة or حليمة, and that's forbearing. Okay, ayah number 13, tilka hududullah, these are the limits set by Allah. Tilka, that means these are hudud from hadada, and that's uh, to put a limit or to set a limit. So hudud is hadada, uh, from hadada, that's the word root. And hudud are the limits or the barriers. Allah, uh, the hudud of Allah, wa man yuta, from tay'ah, and that's to obey. Um, so whoever obeys Allah wa Rasulah, Rasul is from Rasala, that's his messenger, and that's to send. So Rasala is to send, and Rasul is uh, the one who was sent. So that's the messenger. Yudhilhu from Dahala means to enter. So he will make him enter. He will be admitted by him. Jannat from Janana, that's those are uh, gardens in paradise. Tajiri from Jaraya, that's to run or to flow. Min Dahtiha from underneath them. Taht is underneath Al Anhar from Nahara, that's rivers, Khalidina from Khalida, and that's uh, to be there eternally, to be immortal. So that's Khalida. And Khalidina means uh, to abide therein eternally, Fiha, and that's in it, in these Jannat, in, in those uh, gardens. Wadalika, and that is Al Fawzu from Fawaza, that's uh, the to win, that's Fawaza, and um, Al Fawz here is the attainment, and Azim from Azama means uh, great, so Al Azim means the great attainment here. وَمَنْ يَعْصِي اللَّهَ وَرَسُولَهُ and whoever disobeys Allah and His Messenger, وَمَنْ that's whoever يَعْصِي uh, from Asliya, and that's to disobey. Allah wa Rasula, so whoever obey, disobeys Allah and His Messenger, wa yata'adda from Adiya, uh, or uh, Adada from Adiya, and that's to transgress, Hududa, and that's from Hadada, again the limits, so whoever uh, transgresses these limits, yudakhilhu from Dakhala, to enter, Narun, and that's Hellfire, Khalidan, again eternal or Im immortal, Khalada. Fiha, so to be there uh, eternally. Walahu, Adab from Adaba, that's punishment. And Muhin from Hawana, um, and that's humiliating punishment. Walati yatin al Fahisha, those, Alati is a plural feminine of those who commit Yatina from Ataya means to um, get to something or come to something. So Yatina al Fahisha is an expression that means commit immorality. And Fahisha is from Fahasha, it means something that is um, severely immoral. So Al Fahisha um, here is referring to Zina. Of your women, min nisa'ikum, and that means your women and means all um, Muslim women, of your women. فَاسْتَشْهِدُوا from shahida and shahida is uh, to witness. استشهدوا means to bring against them four witnesses. فَاسْتَشْهِدُوا عَلَى against them from عَلَى and هِنَّ so against them. أربعة that's four مِنْكُمْ four of you, four from among you. أَبْعَةَ مِنْكُمْ فَإِنْ شَهِدُوا if they witness, if they testify, فَإِنْ شَهِدُوا from shahada. فَأَمْسِكُوهُنَّ from masaka. masaka is to hold. So أَمْسِكُوهُنَّ في البيوت means uh, confine them in the buyut. Buyut is from bayata and that's house. Um, that's the plural of bayt and bayt is a house. So uh, confine them in two houses. حَتَّى until يَتَوَفَّهُنَّ from wafiya. And that's uh, to die to, until al-maut, 
Emote is death from Mota until death uh, comes to them, until death takes them. Aw yaja'ala from ja'ala to make or to ordain. Allahu lahunna until Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ordains for them. Sabila. Sabila is from Sabala and that's a way. So here it means to ordain for them another way. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did ordain for these women uh, another way, according to uh, the other ayahs that in Surah An-Nur that abrogated these ayahs here. And the two who commit it, so وَالَّذَانِ and that's um, the, uh, it means those or uh, those two, that's what it means. So that's for, uh, if you're talking about two people, يَأْتِيَانِهَا so again يَأْتِينَ الْفَاحِشَةَ here يَأْتِيَانِهَا again means the same thing, those who commit it from أَتَيَا مِنْكُمْ from among you فَآذُوهُمَا from adhiya and adhiya is to um, to cause uh, a slight harm or a slight punishment or dishonor it could be verbal uh, if they taba from tawaba means to repent if they repent aslaha from salaha to correct so if they correct themselves fa'aridu from arada is uh, to turn away, so leave them alone. That's what it means. Anhuma fa'alu anhuma means leave them alone. Inna Allah kana indeed Allah is ever tawabam from tawaba means accepting of repentance. So tawaba from uh, repentance or going back to Allah subhanahu wa taala. So He is accepting of repentance and rahima from rahima means the merciful. إِنَّمَا التَّوْبَةُ عَلَى اللَّهِ لِلَّذِينَ يَعْمَلُونَ السُّوءِ The repentance, so a tawbah from tawbah is the repentance. عَلَى اللَّهِ accepted by Allah لِلَّذِينَ يَعْمَلُونَ from amila uh, to, to do a suh. So a tawbah is, is for those, لِلَّذِينَ means for those يَعْمَلُونَ from amila to do a suh. Um, and that's wrong from sawa'a bi jahala jahala is from jahala and jahala means um, jahala is the word for ignorance and jahala here means that they do it with ignorance whether um, ignorance of the of the rulings or just ignorance out of being careless uh, careless so someone's careless so that is is um, also considered to be ignorance from that person ثم, and then يتوبون from Tawba repent من قريب from قربة means uh, close and here means soon after فأولئك then those يتوبوا from Tawba uh, يتوب الله عليه means that Allah will turn in forgiveness uh, it is those to whom Allah will turn in forgiveness so Allah will uh, accept the repentance of those people وكان الله and indeed Allah عليما from عليما is ever knowing and حكيما from حكما that's wise so he is the ever wise but repentance is not accepted of those who continue to do evil deeds up until وليست التوبة للذين وليست means it is not التوبة from توبة and that's repentance للذين repentance is not for those يعملون from Amila to do or commit a sayyat from sayya or sawa, and that's um, evil deeds. Hatta until ida hadara from hadara, and hadara is to come. So hadara ahadahum al maut means that death al maut, death comes to them when death comes to one of them. So ahadahum is one of them from ahada. Qala inni tubit al an. He would say tubit from tawba means. I have repented al-an, al-an is now. So an, uh, that, that word an means the time. So al-an means this time, which means now. Wala or to those yamutuna from mawata, and that's uh, death, so those who die. Wahum kuffar, from kafara, and that's, um, the word kafara is to, uh, to cover, and means those who disbelieve. So it is, um, uh, when death comes to one of them, he says, indeed, I have repented now, or of those who die while they are disbelievers. Repentance is not accepted from those people. Ula'ika, for them, for those, a'tadna, um, and that's, that means to prepare, lahum a'thaban, from a'thaba, and that's a punishment, and alim from alama, that's painful punishment. 
يا أيها الذين آمنوا لا يحل لكم أن ترثوا النساء كرها أو يوهها بضيب so يا أيها الذين آمنوا is أو يوهها بضيب it is not lawful لا يحل from حلالة حلالة is to be lawful or to be good or allowed so لا يحل it is not lawful for you لكم أن ترثوا ترثوا is from ورثة means to inherit النساء to inherit women كرها from كرها Karaha is by force. Uh, so karaha is to hate. So uh, means by force, by coercion, by compulsion. So that's uh, karaha. Wala ta'duluhunna from adala to make it difficult. So adala is also the word for muscle. So that's um, something that uh, you're, you're forcing or you're making it difficult for, for someone. So do not make difficulties for them in order to take back part of what you gave them unless they commit a clear immorality. So, وَلَا تَعْبُولُهُنَّ Do not make difficulties for them. لِتَذْهَبُوا From ذَهَبَ means uh, to uh, to make it go, so to, to take it back. بِبَعْضِ Take back part of مَا أَتَيْتُمُهُنَّ From أَتَيَ means part of what you gave to them. إِلَّا Unless they commit يَأْتِينَ بِفَاحِشَةً So commit a, an immorality and مُبَيِّنَةً is from بَيَنَة is clear. So مُبَيِّنَةً is uh, here means يَأْتِينَ بِفَاحِشَةٍ مُبَيِّنَةً unless they commit a clear immorality. وَعَاشِرُهُنَّ from عشرة and here means live with them بالمعروف and معروف is from عرفة and عرفة is known so بالمعروف means what is known to be good which is kindness فإن كرهتموهن from كرها means to dislike or to hate so if you if you dislike them فعسى means perhaps أن تكرهوا perhaps that you dislike a thing شيء is a thing ويجعل from جعل is to make الله فيه خيرا كثيرا it, Allah makes therein much good. So khair is from khaira, and that's good. And kathira is from kathara, and that's uh, much or a lot. وَإِنْ أَرَدْتُ مُسْتِبِدَالَ زَوْجٍ مَكَانَ زَوْجٍ But if you want to replace one wife with another, so وَإِنْ أَرَدْتُ um, So here, arada is to, to want or to desire. Istibdala from badala means to replace. So istibdala uh, is to replace. Zawj is a spouse, so one wife. Makana in the place of. So makan is a place or um, in instead. So so istibdala makana here is just means to replace one wife with another. Makana zawj instead of another wife. Wa ataytum. So it means if you want a divorce and you want uh, no longer want to be with this wife. Wa ataytum from ataya is to give. Ihda hunna. Ihda is the uh, feminine word for ahad and ahad is one of them so ihda is one of them and means a uh, group of females qintara and qintar is um, a great amount of money or gifts fala ta'khudhu ta'khudhu from akhada is to take so do not take minhu from it shay'a a thing do not from, take from it anything ata'khudhunahu so this hamza in the beginning means a yes or no question تأخذونه from أخذ would you take it بهتانا uh, so بهتانا is uh, injustice وإثمان from أثمة and that's sin and مبينة is from بيانة that's manifest or clear clear sin that's uh, if you if you take that money or take these gifts from those people from from these wives وكيف and how would you uh, so كيف is how تأخذونه from أخذ how could you take it? وقد أفضى from فضايا and that's uh, so وقد أفضى بعضكم إلى بعض means that you have gone in uh, gone in unto each other so it's just an expression that means that you have been intimate with each other وأخذنا from أخذ is to take منكم from you ميثاقا from وثقة and that's a covenant so ميثاق is a covenant and wathaqa is um, so like to um, to make a covenant or make something uh, like documented. All of these have the same word root. Ghalidha is from ghalidha, and that's a solemn, a solemn covenant. Um, so ghalidha is also the word root for something that is thick, that is uh, strong, that is not uh, to be broken easily. 
So uh, how could you take it while you have gone in unto each other and they have taken from you a solemn covenant? وَلَا تَنْكِحُوا مَا نَكَحَ آبَاؤُكُمْ مِنَ النِّسَاءِ إِلَّا مَا قَدْ سَلَفَ And do not marry those women whom your fathers married except what has already occurred. وَلَا تَنْكِحُوا from نَكَحَ That's to marry. مَا نَكَحَ what, uh, what your fathers married. So آبَاؤُكُمْ is your fathers. مِنَ النِّسَاءِ From the women. إِلَّا مَا قَدْ سَلَفَ So سَلَف is uh, what has already happened in the past. So that, that has already happened. So we're talking about the future. Since, since this ayah is revealed, uh, then this is no longer allowed. إِنَّهُ كَانَ Indeed it is فَاحِشَ from فَحَشَ That's an immorality. مَقَتَ from مَقَتَ is to be hateful. Another word for karaha, but it's, it's more severe than karaha. وَسَاءَ from سَيَأَ means uh, to be Evil and sabil is from sabala, and that's a way. So sa'a sabila, it's an uh, it's an evil way. Hurrimat alaykum ummahatukum. Prohibited to you for marriage are your mothers. So hurrimat from harama, and harama is the word for uh, prohibition, but also the word for sacred. So you, they become mahram, which means um, someone who you're not allowed to marry, but also something that is to be respected, that has sacredness to it. عليكم حرمت عليكم upon you prohibited to you أمهاتكم from أم أم is a mother so أمهات are the mothers your mothers وبناتكم your daughters from بنت أخواتكم from أخت أخت is a sister and أخوات are your sisters وعماتكم from عم عم is an uncle and عمة is an aunt a paternal aunt so عماتكم your paternal aunts وخالاتكم um, and that's your uh, maternal aunt. Uh, so that's your uh, your mother's sisters. وَبَنَاتُ الْأَخْ بَنَاتُ الْأَخْ are the daughters of your brother. وَبَنَاتُ الْأُخْت are the daughters of your sister. وَأُمَّهَاتُكُمُ اللَّاتِي أَرْضَعَنَكُمْ So أَرْضَعَنَكُمْ from رَضَعَ And that's to nurse or breastfeed. وَأُمَّهَاتُكُمُ اللَّاتِي أَرْضَعَنَكُمْ are your milk mothers who nursed you. وَأَخَوَاتُكُمْ Your sisters من الرضاع Your sisters through nursing وَأُمَّهَاتُ نِسَائِكُمْ And that's the mothers of, of your wives which means your mother-in-law وَرَبَائِبُكُمْ From رَبَبَ And that's uh, your step رَبَائِبُكُمْ وَلَاتِ فِي حُجُورِكُمْ So حِجْر uh, means under your, your, your guardianship So um, those are your stepdaughters. From your wives. So that means your stepdaughters. So those are um, your wives unto whom you have gone in. So those are your wives um, that you have actually consummated your marriage with. فَإِنْ لَمْ تَكُونُوا دَخَلْتُمْ بِهِنَّ So دَخَلَ is to enter. So it means if you have not gone in unto them. So if you have not consummated the marriage, and for some reason the nikah was, um, was just ended before the two became intimate, فَلَا جُنَاحَ عَلَيْكُمْ جُنَاحَ is from جَنَحَ and that's um, a sin. فَلَا جُنَاحَ عَلَيْكُمْ There is no sin upon you. Then in that case, then it is, it is okay for you to... Uh, propose or marry their daughters since you haven't actually married the mother. وحلائل from حلالة and that's uh, حلائل is the plural of حليلة and that's from حلالة. حلالة is uh, what is allowed so it means the wives. So that's the opposite of محرم. So you, the wives of أبنائكم. أبنائكم are your sons. الذين من أصلابكم. So أصلاب is the plural of صلب. And that means uh, those who are uh, your biological sons, your bi biological children, uh, not not your children by adoption. So um, the wives of your biological children. So that means your um, your daughter-in-law. وَأَن تَجْمَعُ from جَمَعَ جَمَعَ is uh, to add or to combine. So أَن تَجْمَعُ بَيْنَ الْأُخْتَيْنِ means to combine between two sisters or to take in marriage two sisters simultaneously. إِلَّا مَا قَدْ سَلَفْ And salaf is uh, what has already occurred in the past. إِنَّ اللَّهَ كَانَ غَفُورًا From غَفَرَ means to forgive. So غَفَرَ is forgiving. And رَحِيمَ from رَحِيمَ is merciful. 
And don't forget part A of this lesson where we go over the lessons and reflections, develop a visual memory of the pages, and go over some of the unique and similar verses. Jazakumullah khairan.